टू फ्रेंड्स आई एम हेयर इन गोवा टुडे टू सेलिब्रेट सिक्स इयर्स ऑफ अवर मैरिड लाइफ ट्वेंटी फोर नवम्बर टू तरुण वेट शालू न्यू डेली ट्वेंटी फोर ईयर्स ओल्ड बनिया वेडेड एट ट्वेंटी थ्री ईयर्स ओल्ड सदारणी विथ मिक्स रिचुअल्स हिंदू एंड सिख अ सीरियस आई टी प्रोफेशनल वेडेड चेयरी एंड पब्लिक गर्ल वेन एवर माई फ्रेंड्स और कस्टमर्स हियर अबाउट दिस देयर फर्स्ट रिएक्शन इज लव मैरिज आई स्माइल एंड से येस आई फेल्ट इन लव विद सोमिया द डे वेन आई मैट हर द डे वेन आर फैमिली finally arranged their mind rituals and cultures uh, based on what's best for our lives on our wedding day my friends were amazed when they knew that uh, i have got a big car tata safari as a wedding gift from my in-laws you know sardars are very particular about showing off cars but we were so involved in each other that this so called big gift a big car tata safari seemed very small or uh, in fact nothing uh, in front of the big gift which our parents gave to us by bringing us together for forever the word successful is not the right word uh, to define life after marriage i mean uh, success successful word is good in the social environment when you are working in a job or a business successful word you can use but in case of uh, marriage the right the right question is how much how much involved you are half involved or fully involved a person get involved in very kind of relationship like uh, parent neighbor um, friends sisters siblings um, haters when all these are relationships a need of relationship comes within you when there is certain kind of when you feel certain kind of emptiness the quality of life for most people depend on the mood of the other person why so a relationship which is supposed to be an asset starts to become a liability with time we build a relationship in pursuit of happiness but uh, slowly and slowly you see that uh, this turns ugly now what about marriage if you read the matrimonial acts on uh, some newspaper or some website you will see that the people are not looking for a beautiful relationship they are actually looking for a transaction a transaction of degrees qualification and income all such marriages which are arranged based on such transactions are most likely to have friction in long run i see that a few of my knowns are already feeling this kind of pressure every event in life gives us a chance to learn and grow personally whether it's work or relationship um, every person you meet has something to offer the key is to keep your senses and perception sharp marriage is a huge event it's an event which ties two people together for forever unless and until you don't get fully involved in a relationship uh, uh, called marriage there could be no joy for the rest of the life my 6 years with somia and 5 years with kabir have been full of learning these people are full of energy as i am now doing business most of my time i think about my business and what's something which improves my business the next day but when i come home in the evening these two people they offer they they have two things to offer fun and excitement it's not that i am dependent on uh, somia and kabir for my joy and happiness they are my life companions i know that i could never get anyone better than them in my life they are beautiful human beings i love being with them i am lucky to have them in my life and uh, will always wish them good and happiness in in their life so our relationship is not a transaction or a certain kind of dependency on each other it's it is a relationship where it is a relationship to just share the joy with each other and for the lifetime uh, we just aim to share joy we we just emit joy with each other 
and there is no dependency but uh, definitely there is a certain kind of love you can say and uh, this is something which binds us together for forever.